It's the final day of competition here at the 2010 World Wheelchair Basketball Championships. Canada is competing in the bronze medal right now against Australia, a team they lost to in the in the uh, preliminary rounds by seven points. Keep an eye on. We're going to keep an eye on uh, both number fives for the two teams, Janet McLaughlin and Kobe Crispin. They lead both their teams uh, respectively in points, and uh, this game is right about to get underway, and we're looking forward to it. It's going to be a great one. Final day of competition at the 2010 World Wheelchair Basketball Championships. I'm here with Kendra Ohama, the Canadian women's team that just won bronze. Allow me to be one of the first people to congratulate you. And, and I have to ask, uh, the team came out a little bit slow. You rallied from an 11-point deficit. That's exactly how you want to go out. How, how were you guys able to, to come out with the win today? We just knew we had to keep our composure because that's been something we knew that Australia would come out and press and they do this wall thing and we knew we had to just break that and keep our composure throughout the entire process and I think the girls did a really great job trying to uh, break the press and uh, make sure that we did good passes. Well you absolutely did a good job and, and when I look back at, at this team uh, a year ago or a couple of years ago and see the amount of progress and, and see the direction that this club is going in, um, you know, is that something that, that gives you a lot of confidence as you build towards 2012? Absolutely. I mean, we knew we were going to be together a long time. And if you had asked me a year ago how the team was going to do, we were all thinking the same thing. We really didn't know. But we knew it was the, the time together was going to be a process, and we had to focus on the little things, like Bill says. And we did that, and that was the result. It made us a lot uh, more cohesive being together, spending all this time together the last three months made a huge, huge difference to the team. Well, it's certainly a testament to the dedication and the work that you guys have put in, and uh, Team Canada makes the podium for the fifth straight year. Kendra, the last question for you. Is there anyone at home that you wanted to say hi to? Absolutely. Tom Walsh, my partner, and my mom. Hello. <laughs> Congratulations one more time. This is going to be it for us. We're going to wrap up here at the 2010 World Wheelchair Basketball Championships. I want to thank Kendra for taking time to talk to me. Congratulations to the women's team, and we'll see you guys in 2012. Thank you.